Hello everyone and welcome back to the Battle Cats. Now, in the last episode, we beat the crap out of Klee 1 and managed to get complete Into the Future Chapter 1. Which, speaking of Into the Future, I actually have been grinding out Cat Freak for the last few days. Because what I have been doing is I've been actually going and working on getting my first true form. That being, uh, Tika Luga's true form, which is Lufaland Passaland. And I have every single cat fruit except for yellow cat fruit, which I'll be able to obtain tomorrow. As of the recording of this video, it is Thursday. And so, uh, on for yellow cat fruit, I will be able to, once uh, Friday hits, I will be able to grab all of the cat fruit I need. And I'll be able to evolve uh, Tika Luga to his true form, which will make him an absolute monster. And now what we're going to do for this video is get our first ever true form on the main characters. So as you can see, I have Gross Cat here. And now here is the first ever true form of the main basic cats. And it's a good one too, because I managed to get freaking... Let me show you here. And if we head over here, there is Macho Leg Cat. He's going to be very useful for when I go through into the future. He's a pretty good, he's good against aliens, and I think I'll be using him a lot against the aliens, and also in other stages too. Alright, now as I am here, I'm planning on doing two things today. First off, I want to go get myself my third crazed, because I know I can do it. It's the crazed cow. And the crazed cow is definitely another one of the easier crazed stages. And I actually pl uh, played it earlier. Uh, to test and see if I can do this stage today and I can actually I can do it So this is the lineup I'm using I'm having five meat shields out in the front I'm having Kazu Jizo in Paris and then I have Valkyrie uh, I have Lizana and Bahamut and I want to see out of curiosity if I can have something better just in case um, I don't think so uh, then uh, Valkyrie can but yeah, now oh, let's go ahead. We're gonna play ourselves the crazed cow, get head shaker completed, and we will get ourselves our third crazed cat. So let's go ahead and get started. Let the battle begin. Okay, I have a strategy that I used for this stage, and you guys may have seen my Manic Lion video uh, when I played back in the day. Uh, and so my strategy is to just. Uh, send us some units to be able to hold back uh, the rabbits because I don't want them getting so close. Okay, there he is. And now Crazed Cow is out. And so I'm just going to allow them to tear through Crazed Cow to just simply tear through my meat shields. Okay, so just allow them to tear through it. And then send out uh, walls, only walls, Kazajizo. I'll at least send out two because of Jesus as I'm developing money and you'll see why uh, if you have never seen this stage before so I'm just sending out the two walls okay we knocked it back so it's half dead okay Okay, it's almost it should be almost dead. I'm just holding it back. Okay, now I'm just gonna let them go. I have saved up money and defeated the first uh, crazed cow. Now you may think that this is a real that's just a really easy. It's a really easy for a crazed cat. You haven't seen anything yet. If you have not seen this stage before, you're in for a real treat. All right, so they're hitting the base, and there they are. There's the crazed cows that I need to fight. So. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait for them to get closer. And then just start sending out cat after cat after cat. This is meat shield test. This is testing my meat shielding. I'm not even gonna be looking at the screen. I'm gonna be looking at purely my stats just to get meat shields. And the crazed cow is dying. Should give me the funding I need in order to finish off uh, to help uh, spam. More Paris cats and meat shields. And also fire my cat cannon, push them back. Bahamut's gonna do some damage. There. I saw in the corner of my eye he did a lot of damage. 
If I did, I would use his cat CP since but I don't have any. To help speed up, but I also need to practice me shielding on DC. Which I'm not doing too terribly at right now. Okay, we developed a decent stack to where uh, we can knock them back easily with Paris and Kazajizo. Okay, so this is the part where we can push back. Okay. Dang, I'm surprised uh, Valkyrie is actually staying put. I think I'm buying a new one. Okay, Bazana's back. And the only reason why I bought Bazana is because of her good area damage. It's basically like a, she's basically another Valkyrie. Uh, for me. And she puts out good area damage along with Paris. That we desperately need. Alright, they seem to be calming down on the spam, so I guess uh, we'll just let, we'll just keep sending out more Kazajizos, meat shields if necessary. And yeah, the, the whole storm has died down, like wow, this, we're whooping them now. Holy crap, did you see how many Kazajizos there are? Jesus Christ. I feel bad almost. There we go, we did it! We beat the crazed cow! And we got ourselves crazed cow for our third crazed unit. And now he is gonna be really useful in getting through stages really quickly. Especially if we wanna get more into, into the future. So here he is, crazed cow. He's much faster uh than the uh than the regular cow cat. And he also is able to uh, use area attack, which is nice. Nope, not cat food. Anyways, I'm just gonna go ahead. I'm not gonna use cow cat for crazed cow for right now. I think I'm mainly gonna use him for like speedrunning stages, and also the UEs for like, um, especially when I get him to lion, then that's gonna be really nice. So far, I don't really have anything to do today, and so I want to use one more. One ticket. I got myself my second platinum ticket, unless you count the legend ticket uh, for uh, this uber rare. I want to get myself my 11th uber rare on this account, and I think I might have a good chance at it. So we'll just see what happens. I'm hoping for something good. Like, I'm thinking of a few characters right now. I'm hoping to get. Hold on, let me take a look at what I want. So, I would like for any one of the Uberfest ones, or the part of the Epic Fest, especially like Shadow Gao. I'd like to have Shadow Gao. Um, I would like to have... Uh, in the Nikalugas, I would probably like to have the original. Or no, Picolan would be great. I want to have Picolan. Um, in Dynamites, I would have liked to have Lesser Demon. Or Baby Cat. Or, let me see. Ice Cat would be useful. And Cat Machine would be nice. Um, Oda, because uh, he used to be on my old account. Vars would... No, that's Vars. I forgot what his uh, Yukimura would be very good uh, for me. Uh, Shingen would be nice because uh, I had him on my first account. Uh, Galaxy Gals, I'd like Kai, um, Kalisa, and I think that's it for the two for this event. And dragons, I don't really know except besides Megadora, I don't really know what I'd use here. Uh, I already have Casa Jesus, so that's mainly what I want here. Uh, Dark Heroes, I would like Catman, or Warlock and Pierre, or Hayabusa, or White Rabbit. Almighty's, I would like, uh, Matarasu. And then, uh, for Legion, I'd like probably Mighty Bomb, Mighty Dreadnought, Mighty Bomber. And I don't know any of the Elemental Pixies to make a decision. Alright, so, what am I gonna get from this? Please give me something good. Please give me something good. Alright, three, two, one. Missed. Okay, come on. Give me something good! Oh, Koo! I got Koo! Oh, that's one of the Galaxy Gals. Koo. 
Oh, man. She's good against the red and black, I'm pretty sure. That's nice to have. Cool. Nice. Uh, so let, I'll go take a look at her. Her here. I, she has a true form, which I don't know would be worth it, but I will. But let me know, because I never really experimented with Q that much, and I never had Q. I mean, I never had Q before uh, in my uh, entire uh, my time playing Battle Cats. Zealous user of strange witchcraft to control her staff for great damage from a distance. Strong against black or red enemies. So, let me know if she's any good. Because I don't, I think she'd be used for specific specific situations. But, let me know. Let me know. Also, I just realized we have 369 now. Nice. So now, what do we do? I expected it to take way longer. Um, Stories of Legend? And now, I already completed the first one for some reason. It was the Metal Hippo. But I think I was just in the time I was running out of that low on energy. But, uh, Pale of Field. Uh, I'm gonna get myself a loadout that I can use. Uh, so I'm just gonna put Tesla Land back in here. Alright, Pale of, Pale of Field. Alright, this is still early. Stories of Legend, my beloved. And some of you guys would probably enjoy Stories of Legend, but I mostly just want to stream stream stories of legend because i don't know if they would be that enjoyable because there's not really much to talk about and i think the funnest part about stories of legend is i don't remember any of the stages except for like the great escaper because i beat that stage and also uh uh learn to love because that is that's where red my writing mina's from and also uh when i got uh dark emperor and, uh when i got lil niendum uh, for a cat. And now, come on, there's so many gories. Okay, it's done. Alright, you know what? I think I should, since this is probably gonna be boring if I just go through it regularly, I'm gonna get throw a crazed cow in here. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna level him up. Alright, this is probably gonna be very expensive. Alright, there we go. We got him up there. These guys are really freaking expensive to level up, but like, I can't even explain it. Uh, crazed evolved to level 20 until Lufa lands evolved because I don't want to use a million millions of XP All right, let's show the full case of the lion. Here we go. Look how fast he is I remember using this guy so much Oh, and getting through stages. He is so freaking quick. It's amazing He's also really strong so, Okay, there we go. We got dodge darks now. I should start worrying Oh, yeah, that area attack helps Definitely. All right, and now we're just swiping through. Okay, he's down. And now I'm just gonna send out him here. All right, her. All right, now we just basically gotta wipe out this entirety of the level here. There we go. We're also getting things to make. Um, what are they called? Uh, new cat bases. Although, most of the cat bases I'm not really interested in. Why is the thing so bright? Alright. Send out the crazed giraffes. Look at them go. Alright. Let's just see how it does. We're now at the base, okay. It's Queen Pig. Alright, let's see. Just get out of here. She's not that much of a th She's not that much of a threat. Come on. Come on, just die. Just die. Okay. Metal Hippo's knocked back, and now it's just time to finish it off. Even if Metal Hippo's there. Yeah, this is an absolute wipeout. Yeah, and there we go, it's down. And wow. <laughs> We're easily just tearing through these uh, stories of legend stages. Alright. Gazpacho Highland. Alright. I do expect stories of legend to get difficult. Uh, let me know, guys, what are the most some of the most boring chapters, and I'll skip those chapters if you guys want me to. Yeah, surely there's a okay. It's Master Egg. Okay, uh, send that Aphrodite. That's the simplest solution I can think of. Uh, to get rid of Master A. 
the gacha version on how to get rid of Master X. Unless you have uh, Cyberpunk, which I want Cyberpunk, but I don't have it yet. But Lion's doing well on its own. Uh, holding up against uh, Master Ed. Alright, it's about to. Bop! There we go. Master A is gone. And now we just start clean house in on this freaking chapter. So we just go ahead. And boom. It's over. And now we got cat food and a leadership. Yay! And now this chapter's over and we move on to another one. You know what? Let's do two stories of legend chapters. Uh, today, as we don't have, as that one was really quick. All right, uh, John Jordan Sandhill. All right, let's see. Okay. All right, this might be a problem because these guys actually hit hard. He hasn't killed Casajizo, but it still hits hard. So I got Lazena out, out here. All right. All right. I'm pretty sure their name is Dagshin. I'm pretty sure. Send them out to just absolutely wreak havoc. Alright, there goes one. There goes two. And there goes three. Alright. Wait, no worries. No worries. Okay, just send that Tesla land. Just just wipe out this stage. Alright, let's see what we got. Alright, just continue on dwindling the base. There we go. Oh, yep, something happened. Give me some money. There. And now I have myself an Uber. Let me get one. Okay. There we go. Yeah, Blizzana. Oh, Blizzana out here. Okay. Alright, we got rid of Duches. I'm getting War Flashbacks to Craze Tank. Okay, no. Alright. Okay. Alright. There we go. And I think it's just Metal Hippo that's really screwing us over here. As he is taking forever to die. Come on, just die. Just die. There we go, he's dead. Okay. Alright, and just push on through. And since we're stacking Kaza Jizos and we're also getting rid of uh, Jizos, we're about to hit the base, which I think Aphrodite is in range. Bop, okay. Did a good 30,000 damage. Nice. We just need to wipe out. Okay, okay, more one horns. If they were spamming one horns, that'd be funny. But we have area attacks. We should be okay. We should be good to go. Plus, we have the Xana on our way. They're giving us a lot of money. Wow, that was quick. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alright, now it's time to wipe out the base. There we go. Now just wait here. There we go. Okay. Oh, we got the sloth. Okay, we got... Have... So there's one problem with you, sloth. I have something that's called a Tessalan Pasalan. You know what that is? He's known as kind of... He's not the boss killer yet, but he'll be up there. Just send out my man. How glorious he is. I cannot wait for Lufaland. Lufaland's an absolute freaking monster. I should probably save it for Aphrodite as well. Uh, I should probably just send out the two craze so I don't use up all my space I have. And the reason why I'm using only crates is because I really want to make sure he doesn't move to kill Tessalan. So, and also not to use much money. Alright, and bop! Okay, we already knocked him back. Alright, let's just see here. I'm hoping he crits, that would be a satisfying kill. Okay, or not, that's fine. Alright, so let's see. He's about to wipe him out. Bop! He's dead. Okay, good. And now, we just go over and take out the base. That just shows how powerful he is. Alright, let's just see here. Bop! 100,000 damage! 
from a level tw a 30 Tico Liga. That just shows, I can't wait to see his power when we get him to true form. All right, I'm gonna end this episode here. This was a really good episode. We got through uh, Crazed Cow, got ourselves Ku as our new Uber, which I wanna try out when we get to like well, red enemy stages. But anyways, I do want to end it here. We got through a little bit more stories of legend. Anyway, thank you guys so much for coming out. If you like this, leave a like and subscribe to the notification for sound future videos. Also join the Discord to get to sound in future tournaments. Also go follow me on Twitch, my sound Twitch streams. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye everybody!